Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, one of the things that is um, coming to Windows 11 eventually uh, will be as we see in the uh, different uh, developer and Canary builds uh, one that is uh, I've been asked a couple of times some people uh, especially if you have a lot of huge data transfers through USB USB 4.0 is coming uh, so right now the uh, standards for USB or USB 3 uh, is the pretty much the fastest on most PCs but now we have a standard of USB 4 some PCs will start being shipped with that uh, the USB 4 will have a C type connector so the uh, type C connector is going to be the norm it's going to be the connector uh, really a standard for USB connectivity uh, but it will add faster speeds and some of that. So in the uh, latest uh, build of uh, the dev channel, there is now a new dedicated USB 4 um, information page. So that means that if you eventually buy a USB 4 PC, uh, you will have a, such a um, um, a place to uh, you know for configuration and changing settings and so on, tweaking USB ports basically um, and that's coming uh, soon so of course there's really not many PCs right now that have any USB 4 connectivity but eventually there will be uh, USB 4 connectors so um, that's going to replace USB 3 and it's going to add a host of new features including uh, using uh, the display port and all sorts of things like that it's going to be interesting, but it's mostly um, if you transfer a lot on USB with you know, external drives and so on, it's going to be very, very fast compared to USB 3. Uh, twice the speed, at least uh, nominal. So this is going to be interesting. Another thing also that I wanted to talk about the future of Windows 11. This one I've been asked quite a few times. Uh, displaying seconds and the clock on the taskbar. Uh, that's a feature that used to be there at some point. Some people want to have that back. Uh, remember that uh, because a lot of people are wondering, you know, why isn't that a feature again? Uh, what you need to know is that the taskbar um, has been, the way that it's actually showing up has been rewritten. So a lot of the features have to also be rewritten for the new taskbar. So basically this is coming. There's been some... Uh, seconds in the clock available for some on the dev channel builds so these are interesting things that are going to actually show up at some point so that's a very interesting of course other changes coming um i guess all of this coming through moments once again as we will have more moments uh this is another thing that a lot of you are asking me so how many of these moments again this this year so we had moment two that just arrived a couple of weeks ago uh, we know Moment 3 is going to be somewhere in May. We know that Moment 4 is supposed to be somewhere in September, October. Um, and we're not sure, but maybe another moment before the, the year is over, Moment 5. Each of these bringing new features to Windows 11. So we'll see if uh, some of the features that some people want are there or not. And uh, it's going to be interesting to see also um, as time goes by some of these new features that are showing up. And of course, more hints as time goes by of Windows 12. We know more and more details from time to time. We now know that according to a lot of documentation, including from um, you know third party vendors like Intel and so on, they have uh, information about you know um, the second half of 2024 for the new Windows version this is going to be called 12. That's another story, but we call it Windows 12 for now. So lots of things coming up uh, for the future. Um, so USB 4 is going to be a standard that's going to be supported in Windows 11 at some point uh, for fast speed. And there's going to be some uh, panel for um, dedicated for the settings of USB 4.0. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.